So we want to understand whether NH3 is soluble or insoluble, and we're talking about water here. So NH3, that's ammonia. If we look at some data here on solubility, we can see that ammonia, NH3, it's very soluble in water. 47% weight by weight at zero degrees Celsius. So 47 grams in 100 milliliters of water, for example. As it gets warmer, the solubility actually decreases, and that's the case with most gases. But based on this information, ammonia is very soluble in water. So let's talk about why ammonia is so soluble in water. So both ammonia, NH3 here, and H2O are polar molecules. So they have poles. The red, that's more negative, the side of the molecule, and the blue is a more positive side of the molecule. So we have poles. Because we have two polar molecules, the positive and negative sides can be attracted to each other, like this. And in this case, we have this side of the ammonia molecule attracted to the hydrogens on the water molecule, or the reverse, where the negative side of the water molecule is attracted to the positive side of the ammonia molecule. So again here, we have a negative pole and the positive pole there attracted. And that attraction makes it easier for the ammonia to dissolve in water. In this case, because we have a nitrogen with hydrogens and a lone pair here, over here you have water with the lone pairs and the hydrogens, we can have hydrogen bonding, which is a strong form of the dipole-dipole intermolecular forces between molecules. That means that ammonia is going to be very soluble in water. Do note that some of the ammonia, a very small amount since it's a weak base, will dissociate into NH4 plus and OH minus. You need to know more about that. There's a link at the end of this video. This is Dr. B discussing whether NH3, ammonia, is soluble or insoluble in water. It's very soluble. Thanks for watching.